Hi everyone, it's our sales video for the week and today is Sunday and we're getting ahead of the game. Um, I'm going to show you one thing that we're, we're packaging up tonight that's going out in the post tomorrow uh, by courier. The courier might come early so we want to get it all done tonight because it's quite large. Uh, it's this vintage, oh, it's heavy, Knitmaster knitting machine made in Japan and it includes all the accessories. It, let me just unwind it here. There we go. That is the vintage knitting machine. And that polystyrene bit in the middle has got accessories in. There's a polystyrene bit at each end. That's got accessories in it as well. There's some other bits in there. Um, I have no idea if it's all complete. And I did say that in the listing because I know nothing about modern or vintage knitting machines, to be honest with you. Uh, I paid $29.99, got it in a charity shop, listed it in September and it sold for $89.98. So really, really pleased with that. Um, and that will go out tomorrow because the person has requested it for Tuesday. So um, that's why we're getting organized. Hi everyone, it's Monday now. And as you know, I just showed you the Knitmaster machine. That's all packed um, and ready to be collected by the courier. So well done, Simon. Um, not a bad weekend uh, for sales. Um, got some sort of recently listed stuff going out. Uh, we had a load of auctions end yesterday, which we'll show you shortly. But for now, I'm going to show you the sort of buy it now ones that have um, sold. So there's a lot of clothing, um, like lots of bits and bobs. So without further ado, I'm going to go straight in. So I will do... Uh, well, they're all stacked up on the table next to me, so I'll start with this one. This is a Rohan Finnick Crew Jumper in medium. It's knitted. Um, it costs four pounds. It costs four pounds in a big job lot. I've done a couple of haul videos, um, and one was uh, like just a haul with me and Simon, and then the next the, I, there's another one of just me uh, with an epic haul. So this was out of the epic haul video and um, I listed this yesterday and it sold yesterday. I had it up for 29.99 and it sold for 25. Um, so really, really pleased with that. And by the way, if you pick up Rohan and you want to list it, on the care label inside, it will say what the item is. So I know it, it I knew this one was called the Finnick Crew Jumper because it said it on the label and they've all got names. So it's really useful if you're looking up solds or just want to look on the Rohan website to see what they're what they cost new, it's really helpful. So yeah, £25 for that one. Got a bubble hat, hats are starting to sell again. Uh, although it's not cold yet, we're very lucky. Um, this one is a Bart Manila Beanie Bobble Hat. It's 47% cashmere, paid 98p for this back in March. Um, and this was in a job lot from an auction. The um, RRP on the tag, it's $49.99 and we sold this for £16, which I, I mean, we've had it since March, so it was never going to sell for £49.99, uh, but I'm really happy that I turned 98p into £16, so that's good. Uh, this was this for this weekend, it's a Marks and Spencer's collection sort of jersey dress, just a maxi dress, just plain grey, picked it up in a chazza. I will say this, by the way, I was taking sensible offers on anything this weekend and uh, just to sort of drum up business. This one cost £4 and it sold for £15.63 because they used uh, the 15% off coupon. Oh, and also on Saturday, because we were going out, it was such a beautiful day, I decided to take the dogs for a really long walk and go, to go to the pub for lunch. Um, just before we went, I said, right, I'm reducing the price of all clothing by 20%. So that was really good. So originally that dress was up for £22.99 and I only listed it the other day. Um, so I reduced it by 20%. Then someone bought it with the 15% off coupon at £15.63. Um, because I just want to clear sales. Because when I um, uh, filtered our active listings uh, to just clothing on eBay, it said that there was like over £4,000 worth if they all sold at that price. And I thought... Well, if I reduce that by 20% and they all sell this weekend, I'll be really happy with that money. So I just did it. Um, yeah. 
Uh, another recently listed item, these were listed over the weekend, are these Ping golf trousers. These were picked up in a haul, uh, well it's Monday now, so the week before last. These cost £4.95 from a charity shop, um, sold for £16.99, so I did have them up for £24.99, reduced them down by 20% and they used the 15% off coupon, but I'm fine with that. This was listed this weekend as well, it's a Hush Lightning Bolt jumper. Um, large, I had to use the debobbler. Where are Here it is. A reseller's best friend, the debobbler. What was annoying though is I emptied the debobbler out into my little bin that I've got on the desk and that fell over and all the stuff I debobbled fell in my drink. <laughs> um, so yeah, this Hush Lightning Bolt jumper in large, cost two pounds, which it was very bobbly. The two pounds, I couldn't leave it behind. Uh, so this sold for £23.79. I'm really pleased with that. Uh, they used their 15% off coupon. And this was also listed this weekend. Uh, this was out of the big mammoth haul I got at the charity shop the week before last. It's a Rohan Cara tunic dress, size 10, cost four pounds, and it sold at full price for 17 99 uh, Look at this little Wentworth puzzle. I love Wentworth jigsaw puzzles. They are my favourite. This is a 40 piece, um, so not really for die hard puzzlers. Um, and we normally go quite high on our Wentworths, but this is just such a tiny one that I just thought, you know what, it cost five pounds. I mean, that was like, I overpaid massively. But did I do the jigsaw? I must have done the jigsaw. Must have done. Uh, Sold for £10 on offer. Um, this sold this morning, like literally half an hour ago. It's a Playmobil set. It's a big job lot that Simon picked up from a garage sale. Cost £5 and sold for £23 and 3p because they used their coupon. Um, it's the police car riot van towing boat on a trailer with underwater motor. Some pants, gotta love a pants sale. We love pants in this house. DK and Y ones, these are ex Costco stock. These are an auction pickup. These cost £2.82 back in August and they sold for £10.87 with the coupon. Then we've got a three pack of dog ear cleaner. Um, yeah, it's called. Cool. Bifar ear cleaner, three times 50 mil, cost £4.70, sold for 11 89 They used the coupon on that. It's not great. It wasn't going to be very cost effective to list them individually, so I didn't do that. So I made a bundle of three. I still couldn't get much money for them, but I wanted to sell them, so that's good. Some breakables. Got these tea light holders. They're very nice, very pretty. Although that one has a big chip in the corner there. Um, they are Orifor Sweden, or Orifors Sweden rather. The sticker is on the side there. I uh, got these in a charity shop, I think. And may, or oh, did I? I don't know. Maybe the price will tell me. Um, got them from, yeah, 3 99 from a charity shop. Uh, and in the end, sold them for £8, purely because we've had them since April. And I think the chip was holding them back. Um, so that's fine by me. Um, just got to carefully check things, haven't we? And then this little posy vase, this sold. This is quite pretty. This was in a job lot from an auction, I think. Um, yes, this sold for £9.23, cost a pound. So it's quite cute. It hasn't got any markings on it or anything, so I don't know who made it. That's fine. Then someone bought two pairs of Ellen Ray's luxuriously soft fleece lined leggings in small. These cost £5.17 a pair back in February. And um, so there's two pairs in a pack and they bought two packs so they're getting four pairs. They used a coupon and they sold for £16.98 for all of them, which isn't great, but we've had them a long time. Obviously the size smalls are the least popular. So that's fine. Um, 
some Rohan women's dry essential trousers. Yeah, one of my dogs. She's on the dining room chair, spinning around. Okay, Rohan women's dry essential trousers. These are in a big job lot that I bought. Um, well, I just bought bulk Rohan trousers from an auction. These cost two pound sixty-two back in July. Got sold two pairs this weekend. One for eight pound fifty. I took. Uh, they used the coupon after I'd reduced the price by twenty percent, which I was fully prepared for. Um, I knew that things would sell cheaper, but I just wanted to clear some space and get some money in. And these ones sold for eight pounds as well. So I think I've got three left of those. <clears throat> Next up, <laughs> a Rohan vest. This isn't in out of any job lot. This was um, from a charity shop not that long ago, September. I paid a pound for it. Did have it up for eighteen ninety nine. Reduced the price, then reduced it by 20%. Then they used their 15% off coupon and it sold for 10.87, but it only cost a pound, so I'm fine. Fine with that. Um, a Leonard Skinnerd t shirt. This was a charity shop pickup, um, cost three pounds. Um, it's ladies, extra large, sold for £9.58 after all the price reductions and the coupon. This was listed at the weekend. It's a Columbia jacket. This was in the big mammoth haul that I got. Um, this one cost, now is it four pounds? Yes, it is four pounds. And it sold for 30. It's a Columbia titanium jacket in medium. Really, really good condition. Really happy with that. They didn't use the 15% off coupon. Another jacket I listed at the weekend out of the same haul. This one cost five pounds. Um, it's Sprayway Zodiac jacket size 10, cost uh, £5, like I said, sold for £35, didn't use the coupon. This was a recent pickup from a charity shop just before we went on holiday. It's a ladies poetry suit jacket and matching trousers. This one, where is it? Uh, suit jacket, size 18, purple wool blend, fully lined, cost 10.95, sold for £54.39. That was after the 20% off, and then they used the coupon, but that's still great. Got some Dickies trousers. These were picked up at a garage sale trail. I had three pairs. These ones cost £4 or £3.50, I can't remember. Um, these sold for twelve twenty three after the price reduction and the fifteen percent off coupon was used. Simon's done a video about coupons. Uh, it's quite interesting. Uh, this was a great one. This was listed just before we went on holiday as well. It's a mint velvet Roxanne blocked cocoon dress, and it also comes with the matching scarf that was sold separately. Um, they're both brand new tags. They cost me six pound fifty, and I took an offer of fifty pounds. So super happy with that. Hello Luna, you try to get up there but the train's in the way isn't it? Uh, All Saints Dress had this quite a while now, this was a charity shop pick up, uh, just wanted to get it gone because uh, I didn't really have any interest in it. It's the All Saints Deirdre Ruffle Dress, I know that because I think it's on the tag, um, just like how I said with the Rohan clothing. Um, it's large and it's got a detachable cami in there. It costs £6.52 and after like loads of price reductions, because we've had it since April, it sold for £11.99. So not a great buy, that one. We've got more pants, like loads of pants in this pack. I think there are 12 pairs, so it's um, a pack of three, four times. I just bundled them all together. Uh, cost £2.35 in total um, and sold for £9 um, and they've added a note saying please pack well. Mm. I've got a dress here, this was not a great buy either, this is from a charity shop. Um, it had a stain on it, it's brand new with tags but it still had a stain. If something's brand new with tags, doesn't mean to say it hasn't got a stain, so just, um, yeah, just triple check things. I paid £10 for it. It's a pure collection luxury linen maxi dress size 20. 
uh, brand new with tags, but it is marked on the sleeve. Uh, so yeah, I paid £10, listed it in September. I'd had it much longer. I was putting it off because I was going to try and get the stain out. And I just thought, you know what, I'm just going to list it with the stain. Um, and it sold for £20.15. We didn't use the coupon. And then this uh, Pure Collection jumper. Uh, where is it on my list? Here it is. Cost £4. Um, it's medium, it's colour block, 100% cashmere, uh, listed it in August and we just, uh, it sold for £18, could have got more for it, um, but happy with that. And then these are a pair of boots, now they are Pimky Lace Up Biker Boots in black, they're quite a small size, um, had them absolutely ages, had them on Depop, had them on eBay, had loads of likes, had loads of interest. But they just wouldn't, they wouldn't sell. Had them up since September last year. They cost £7 and 9p. Got them in a drop lot from the auction. Um, and they used the 15% off coupon as well. After we've reduced the price by loads. And they sold for £11 and 4p. And they're bang on trend. But they're such a small size. And quite frankly, I am just glad to see the back of them. Because they were taking up room. Uh, and that is it. Um, yeah, Simon will probably be on in a mo. Or me, I don't know who's doing it yet show you what sold on our 99p auctions but that is everything that sold on the weekend at uh, bite now so really pleased so it's still monday and i'm just here to show you what's going out that sold on auction we sold 22 items in total some of them are unpaid uh one lot i've got to put an invoice together to do combined shipping uh, so they're unpaid that's fine uh, so we sold or things that have been paid for these are JD Williams Shoes of some description. What are they like loafers or something? They're brand new and they sold for 99p plus postage. We've had them for a long time uh, We also sold uh, two items to the same customer their own knickers lace Brazilians 99p each plus post, uh, some WH Smith's colouring pens, 99p plus post, a scarf, 99p plus post, um, some like necklacey things, both sold for 99p plus post. This glass peacock, which is kind of quite cute, I don't know, maybe that's bad taste or something, I'm not sure, like, looks alright to me. Um, but yeah, that's sold for 99 plus post. Oops, a uh, Grundig CD wallet. Um, we have a very, very interesting story about that CD wallet, which we will share sometime. Um, Minerva Synergy fabric, 99p plus post. Another necklacey thing, 99p plus post. A some fabric, 99 plus post. Um, this is a bit of a fail really, so it's, a, it's an inflatable swimming pool or paddling pool, it's quite big. Um, it's from auction, it has water damaged packaging. And I thought that would sell over the summer, never sold. Sold for 99p plus post and I'm pretty sure may well weigh more than two kilos. Um, so it's probably a complete fail because I might have to spend a bit more on postage with a courier. I don't know if I did these already, but if I did say they were 99p, they weren't, they were £1.50. Just a bunch of scrunchies, so they were one fifty plus post. And that's it, stay tuned for Tuesday. Hi everyone, I'm back. You're not imagining things, Faye hasn't transitioned into a boy. Uh, Faye's actually outsourcing and I'm holding a fork. Uh, making things happen. So, I'm showing you what's gone out, going out today, it's Tuesday. Uh, and I'm going to do it lowest price to highest price because I find that quite exciting, <laughs> building up the tension. Um, it's the first to sell with these yummy by Heather Thompson two pack of opaque tights. They sell for 99p plus 3.75 postage, so 4.74. Uh, that was an auction uh, someone had just paid. Next up is this. Sorry, they cost 3.07. They were listed in January, but they've been on auction. Uh, this. Is an empty reed diffuser bottle. I have no idea where it came from. It cost 
£5.39, must have been in an auction bag or a load of stuff, must have been. Uh, we originally listed it at 9.99 back in March 21, so six months ago, uh, and it sold on auction for 5.05 including postage, so 1.30 plus post. Next up is the Scooby-Doo figures, so this is from that bundle of toys that I got um, that I was just loving. They did a really good job bundling them all up into different things. So these, this bundle here cost 31p, it was originally listed uh, for 18.99, sold with a 15% off uh, coupon, so it was reduced from 10.49 and the buyer got it for 8.92. Uh, Carol Hockman, are these pants? Have we got pants today? No, it's a bralette. Um, probably just told that from the picture, couldn't I? Uh, so uh, we, it cost two eighty two. August twenty one. It was listed, sold for nine ninety nine, without the coupon. Next up, uh, I think this is quite a new one. Yeah, this was listed in October. 21 it's a hush pink jumper long sleeve so it'll have been in a haul video reasonably recently uh it was listed at 19.99 originally it cost 350 uh and someone offered 17 pounds which was accepted um next up was some more auction stuff there's five things in here and unfortunately i've packed them all up already because i've got to go with the courier uh there's a big bundle of socks about two and a half kilograms of socks in here uh, there's some ointment, there's a florist wire and something or other. Um, there's a lounge set, uh, so like a crochet lounge set, and some soft fleece uh, leggings. So they are on their way. Uh, next we have a Rohan Cold Spell shirt, XL. So this will definitely have been in our recent haul video of all the Rohan. Uh, it was Rohan-tastic. If you haven't seen it, um, check it out. Um, we paid 4.26. No, we paid four pounds and listed at 26.99 and took an offer for 20 pounds 50. And actually, Faye put this in the jacket because we also sold a jacket that was kind of khaki. So she put this in the jackets and the jacket in the shirts tub so it kept me on my toes trying to work that out this morning picking uh, but there we go so that's off 2050 uh kettle well faux wrap top medium blue green uh listed in october 21 for cost three pound 90 I listed it at 24.99 and someone bought it with a 15 percent off coupon and got it for 21.24 Uh, another Rohan Cold Spell shirt, XL, so it's the same as the one before, except it's dark grey, yeah. Uh, so it cost £4, listed at £26.99, and it sold 15% off coupon at £22.94. What have we next? I don't really know what this is. It's a Sea How, some sort of... Brown 140 Garden Plant Sticks Divider Plant Index Plants. So it's some sort of garden journal thing. Uh, we paid, don't know what we paid yet, she's not put the cost in yet. It's from an auction bundle though, I can see that. It was listed in September, so very, very recently. Um, and it was listed at 26.99 and it sold with a 15% off coupon at 22.94. And finally, Rohan Escapist Jacket, medium green. Again, this will be in our bundle uh, in our haul video very recently. Cost five pounds. It was listed at thirty nine ninety nine, and the customer got it with a fifteen percent off coupon for thirty three ninety nine. If you want to know more about coupons, we've got a video coming out really soon. Uh, it just shows some um, experiments that I was doing with coupons, the results, um, and. Uh, something to think about for you guys. That's it. Hold tight for Faye coming really soon.
Good morning everyone, we are in a different location coming at you from the barn this morning and we're together so I'm off sourcing so he wants me to get through this as quick as possible so he can pack it and post it on the way to his sourcing trip so this is everything that's sold since Tuesday afternoon because we had uh, we gave ourselves a day off yesterday of doing this so first things first we have this wildflowers book it's the first book of wildflowers MM ranking and it's from 1917 which is really lovely we also put it on Etsy it's had loads and loads of interest uh, Faye got it for two ninety nine, listed it for twelve twenty four ninety nine, and we sold it for fourteen ninety nine. Yeah, so happy that with sold that. Sold pretty quick, didn't it? Yeah, not bad. Uh, next up is this Top Trumps, uh, thirty top moments from the program Friends. Just had loads of these that came with loads of games that we got. They're nothing special, but they're new, so we've sold them. Yeah, they sold I think for four four sixty four. I think it was money off of the uh, offer. Okay. All right. Next up, these Berghaus trousers. Picked up a couple of pairs of Berghaus trousers when I did that big um, sort of uh, haul where I went back to see the lady in the shop and she let me go through the boxes of stock that she's got. These cost four pounds. Uh, twenty nine. No, they were listed for twenty nine ninety nine and sold for twenty. Yeah, I took an offer. They were four pounds. Just want to get money in. Quite right. Thank. Yeah. <laughs> have to justify that <laughs> no um next up from the same day from the same location charity shop is this rohan hilltop jacket large paid four pounds five pounds oh, paid for that that means and i got it the day before you listed it for 84.99 and it sold for 67.99 nice and then this rohan cascade jacket this was was this four pound? Four pound you paid for that one. So I got this the day after I got that one. This listed it at fifty nine ninety nine, sold it at thirty seven ninety nine. Nice. Next up, the cherished teddy exclusive members only pieces. So it's like a members special edition thing. Yeah, paid eight pounds. Listed at twenty four ninety nine in May. Took an offer for fifteen. Yeah, it wanted it gone. Um, I won't take the lid off because it's quite hard to get back on. But there's this vintage Tupperware. Um, what's the exact name of this vintage Tupperware, it's please? Steam and store. Steam and store. So it's got like a little colander inside. It's the what's the colour? Burnt orange. Burnt orange. Yeah. So this is vintage Tupperware from like the seventies and eighties. That sold for sixteen ninety nine. How much did I pay? It's not on. It's not on the packing slip. Packing slip. Oh yeah, I paid. Four ninety nine, I think. Um, <coughs> we've got a Coca Cola glass. This one's like the traditional can style one that McDonald's were doing a few like over ten years ago. Uh, this one's purple. Paid one forty nine. Listed at nine ninety nine. Actually, it was listed at twelve ninety nine. I reduced it to nine ninety nine because we sold a lot of that price, and then it's gone out on fifteen percent off at eight forty nine. Cool. Uh, a recent pickup from a charity shop is this fat face mini skirt. This uh, is a size 16. Fat face mini skirt. You paid two pounds, listed at 18 99 sold at 13 99 right. uh, This surprised me. I'm surprised this didn't go quicker or for more. It's a Skechers Active Black Georgia crop top, so sports bra basically, brand new with tags. Paid 176 sold for eight. But when did we list that? Uh, February 21. Yeah. Long time ago. Uh, we've also got this sea salt pole pear shirt, size 14. Listed this at the weekend. Yeah, it was five pounds. Uh, listed at 28.99, sold for 19. Yeah, and um, we have this. This was in a recent haul video. Simon bought this back from the Chazza and got me to list it. It's a bowl and a jug, and it's, the brand is yeah, it's Siltone Pottery. There we go. S i l t o n e. Uh, paid eight ninety nine, listed for forty four ninety nine, sold for forty four ninety nine. And then finally, on our personal Simon's personal account, um, these we listed for a friend. They're empty HP printer cartridges. Yeah, so there's I think there's fifteen there. Uh, I think there's fifteen, and they sold for forty three ninety nine, including postage. I had a stupid, I've had a couple of stupid offers. I had an offer for twenty quid. Uh, almost immediately when I uh, rejected that offer. I had an offer for 40 which I accepted I think they were up for 42 99 and I thought it was the same customer just same playing games um, because they didn't pay straight away but uh, in the end they did pay and there we go and it wasn't wasn't that customer so don't throw away your ink cartridges don't even hand them to recycling 
Sell them. Um, yeah, check check solds first. Um, oh, eight, yeah, we're talking HP. These are HP 301 mainly, I think. Uh, they're all HP. They're all genuine. Colour and black. Colour and black. XL and non-XL. Uh, yeah, 45 quid. I mean, that. before we got our thermal printer, we could have produced that in a year, probably. So, you know, free money. So that concludes Thursday's What's Going Out. And I'll probably be back in, in the house tomorrow morning. <laughs> in the hall. Yeah, morning. Friday today. And we've got four things going out. It's slim pickings, but I'm quite pleased with the sales. Um, one I listed yesterday that sold within hours. It's always quiet when I'm outsourcing. <laughs> yeah, Simon was outsourcing all day yesterday, so watch this space for a whole video. Um, so first things first, we have these Rohan jeans. They're called Rohan Jeans Plus, but they're a size 12. They're not plus size, uh, which is a bit weird. Um, they sold for... 24.99 and I paid four pound for those in a big job lot that I actually got from a Chazza. Uh, we've got some pants going out. These are two pairs of Calvin Klein knickers. Uh, they're loose. They're not in packaging, but they are brand new. They were in a big job lot from an auction. Um, paid two pound eighty two for those. Got them in, in August. They I took an offer for eight pound. Um, those jeans I listed by the way in this month got this Ndina paperweight uh, it's interesting this one um, Faye mentioned the other day to me when I was as I was passing uh, to make a coffee she sort of said we've got all these watched items none of them are selling so I said okay well let's take the top five watched items and sell similar um, change the main image so that was the main image like that way around but we changed it <laughs> the camera's not really picking it up we changed it so it kind of showed a bit more because obviously like the the way the picture was taken i think the label was sort of obscuring a bit of it um we also put the price up by a couple of pounds and we did something else i think but uh we also added like sell similar to the skew just so we knew that it was one that we'd done oh and, and we it, updated the item specifics because ebay are doing something at the moment and all the item specifics has gone a bit crazy yeah and it sold after that change it sold within 24 hours so um that was ple pleased with that it sold for 15.99 yeah paid four pound fifty for it um when I said to Simon about, uh, I've got all these watches, I don't know what to do, it's because normally we'd just reduce the price slightly, but I got to the point where I didn't want to reduce the price anymore, so we changed Yeah, tax. so when I said, oh, change the price, I was kind of like, I don't want to change the price anymore, but I said, well, it doesn't mean, it doesn't mean put it down. No. It just means make a change so that it's a new listing, new people coming along and seeing it, looking different to maybe the if they'd seen it before. Also, this was one that we had a message on. Someone mess messaged us quite rudely and said, and basically offered us 10 pound on message. And we never we never do any negotiation over messages. We have a standard reply to that, which says just make us an offer. But um, yeah, they said, oh, it's not worth any more than 10 pound. Well. No, they said it's not as rare as you think. Yeah, and, and they offer 10 pound. And, and so I, I, I did reply actually and said, I don't, no one said it's rare. I didn't say rare anywhere in the thing. Uh, anyway, so it sold for 15 99 So there you go. And then finally, are these mint velvet jeans. These have sold to a viewer. So thank you very much. Just view a message to say that she's bought a few things from us in the past. And um, yeah, thank you very much. These are mint velvet joylet skinny jeans, size 16 long. Um, they are currently on the mint velvet website. They look like they've possibly only been worn once. Uh, I paid Six ninety nine, and they sold for thirty. Did they sell for thirty one forty four? So they used the fifteen percent off voucher. Uh, so thank you very much if you're watching. That's everything going out today. Um, hopefully sales will ramp up over the weekend. Got lots of things to list. I listed lots yesterday. Simon went sourcing. Um, we're out today, non-work related, but um, I'm sure we'll get stuff listed this week. <laughs> oh, I thought you were going to say, I'm sure we'll pop into a chazza. We can't pop into a chazza today. <laughs> what, meet, you, what are you talking about? We're meeting a friend that we haven't seen for a very long time, so um, just made a special trip. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Um, loads of videos come in, so if you're not subscribed to the channel, uh, or if you're just new here, uh, subscribe to the channel, because we've got lots of haul videos coming up and other stuff. So, thanks very much. We'll see you in the next one. Yep, see you later.